Two simple planes. In the last episode, we were checking out some pretty freaking sweet designs that people made, including X-Wing from The Force Awakens. If you guys are interested in that, go check out the video. But this is the Prospector Cardin Robot V1 by Hyperloop. This thing is an all-terrain vehicle and apparently can even go in the water. And uh, this is like for, you know, looking at like going to Mars and stuff. And so we're going to check this out and see what we can do with it. Throttle to 50% in water or 100% for climbing hills. This is an all-terrain robot for exploring a new region where humans have never reached before. Using control of WASD, lead in different directions. Okay. Let's see. 100%. Oh, then it just starts moving. Sweet! It's a little... It's a little different. <clears throat> it's a... I'm gonna have to figure out how to... How to control this thing. <clears throat> look at it. Look at the uh, jets spinning around there. Okay, so we're going. We're going in reverse. We're going in reverse. Hopefully, the the Mars rover is a little bit easier to control than this thing. But maybe I'm just a noob. Nope. Yo, this thing just goes anywhere. Yeah, down into the water. Don't don't crash though. Whatever you do. That'll work too. Just keep falling. Just keep falling into the water. Just keep going, dude. Sweet. All right, fifty percent. Oh, look at it. It's like it's like oh, it's buoyant. It's got some buoyancy to it, and we can control it. Take it in the water. Yeah, baby. It's so weird, but it's working though. I mean that's the good thing, right? Is that we can actually we can actually drive it in the water. That is sweet. All right. We are exploring new worlds with our robot. In honor of Star Wars once again, we have the Boba Jet <laughs> made by Jimbo Jet and apparently this thing flies and everything perfectly fine. Uh just need to look out for Sarlacc pits. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take it out and this thing is great look at it <laughs> okay let's see normal controls they say normal controls dude this is so sweet you know what i need to figure out is how they do this oh it's probably on a, like the wing the horizontal stabilizer or vertical and they just position it sideways i think that's what they do oh my gosh oh my gosh the Boba Jet is amazing! And we're off! That's awesome! Freaking Boba Jet, man! Oh, look at that's interesting! The control surface and how it's being used. It's not that maneuverable, but it flies nonetheless! And it's sweet. The Boba Jet. Awesome! Look at that! <laughs> All right, that's great. Well, let's just keep right with the theme of things and go for a TIE fighter. Apparently, this thing is extremely maneuverable, but you can't uh, take off from the ground, so we need to check this out. This is made by Agnes Design again. Um, this is sweet. That dude's making all kinds of sweet stuff. Bandit final approach. Maybe we should do... Should we do a different one? No, let's do bandit. It's fine. Okay, you shouldn't have just air. It's just called air start. No final approaches or anything. All right. <clears throat> Here we go. It's probably got to get up some speed first. Don't don't die on me. Keep it up. Oh yeah, baby. Dude, this guy is making some sweet stuff. Freaking tight fighter. Man. Oh, look at the cockpit. The cockpit's amazing. That is, this is sweet. You know what we need to do? We need to get like a nice, yes. Dun, 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 dun. Why is it doing this to me? No! <laughs> no! It was working. <laughs> oh, gosh. This is... 
is the A-10 Thunderbolt to the Warthog. Uh, apparently, this is... So, if you've noticed, like, this kind of looks a little bit different um, in terms of kind of the design. And I think it's been perfected through... He said it's through heavily modified XML editing. This is by AG Dynamics. And apparently, it's a little bit faster than real life. But... Oh, I don't want to start in the air, actually. <clears throat> yeah, banded air for okay. And <laughs> uh, so let's not fire missiles on the ground. I was just trying to find out. Oh, there it is. Realistic G U A J U. <clears throat> Realistic G A U eight cannon. Oh, that's sweet. That is sick. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's take this bad boy off. Dude. Somebody was asking me to try to make one of these. And I'm just like, please. I can't, I can't make that. Are you kidding me? Sweet. And now we're launched. Now we're going to launch some missiles here. Fly by. The cockpit, man. You know, this it's really hard for me to control. Drop the bombs. Dude, that is sweet. A ten man, that's unbelievably cool. I've got one I've got one missile left here. What's the, where's the last one at? There it is. Dude. Freaking A-10, man. It feels so cool to fly. Too bad there's like nothing we can... Yo, can we dogfight with this thing? I haven't... I haven't done any dogfighting. Yeah, let's do it. Select airplane. Oh, what? It's just the ones I'm... Oh, wait. Can I save this? Hold on. Let me see if I can save it. I might be able to... Save. Yes. Okay. So now we can probably use it. A10 versus... Let's just do something stupid, simple. Um, not the pick... <laughs> not that there. Seaplane. There we go. I just want to see if I can kill it. There it is, right there. Why, did, why does the flight feel a little bit different here? Why is it why is it swaying like that? What the heck? I got it! Yeah, baby! <laughs> okay, it, it feels weird though, like it's flying differently than it just was. Alright, we got it. That's what I wanted to try to do. Sweet! Freaking A10, man. It's amazing. This is a working 17th century Dutch schooner. Schooner, however you say it. I don't know how you say it. It's a freaking ship. Made by Tuus or something like uh, T E U S, and it actually works. You can move the sails, and they'll move. It'll move in that direction. It's pretty sweet. Hours worth of fuel, adjustable sails, working rudder. Which I guess I could also move it that way if I wanted, if I needed to turn it. Four interactable doors that can be opened and closed by using roll and pitch. What doors are open in here? Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that. Doors are open. Look at that. Doors are opening. Look at them. Cool. Sweet. Dude, I can't believe people can make stuff like this. This is just incredible. How do you even... How do you even do this? I don't get it. It's just nuts. It's awesome. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed this. I'm going to be sailing off into the horizon. If you guys do enjoy it, if you guys did enjoy it, click that thumbs up button below. And if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you.